Okay, moving on. Tip number two, you don't have to fear divorce. Everyone and everything will be fine. Well, how do I know that? I know it because I've been doing this for 15 years and I've checked in with our clients throughout many of the years. Many of them have become personal friends of mine and other people on our team and everyone gets through this. I don't have anyone who's ever come back to me and say, I wish that I could remarry that same person or I wish that I was still married. Most people at some point get comfortable with the fact that regardless of what they hoped and dreamed of, regardless of what story they had created about what their life would look like, they like their life so much better now without the conflict or without the loneliness and really getting to set your intention and have your best life yet. So, you know, it, it's tricky, but I'm, I'm going to go over some ways that you can alleviate that fear because I hate when people operate from a place of fear. When they're scared, they often do irrational things like lawyering up with the most aggressive lawyer in town. And I can tell you that unless you have a serious, serious situation where your spouse is violent or abusive towards you or your spouse is taking your children to another state and has refused to bring them back. Unless you have a serious, crazy divorce like that, you don't need to lawyer up and spend thousands of thousands of dollars on a lawyer's retainer and lose control over not only the outcome of your divorce, but how it proceeds.